The spot is brought to you by Feiruz. Welcome back to the spot, guys. Um, it's time for us to go ahead and get into our top five of the day. And today, our top five is we're going to be talking about top five love stories. Yes. Okay. Can you explain? So, top five celebrity love stories. Oh. So celebrity those, love yeah, stories. Yes, celebrity African love stories. Celebrity love um, stories? Yeah, we can do African. Um, can I? Yeah. Can I do you want to start? Number five? Okay. Number okay. five. Okay. Although this was a bit controversial. Um, it was on. It played out sort of on TV a little bit. Okay. Prezzo and Goldie, and Goldie. when she was uh, still with us. Yeah, when they were in the Big Brother house. Ah. So it was a very interesting. Yeah. It had their ups when, and downs. Yeah, it had their ups and downs. But and I then think when they came were really out, rooting for them. Yeah, when they came out and then you saw them together, and mm -hmm. I think they attended like a wedding or a party, and they were wearing like the same kind of outfit, mm -hmm. same colors and yeah. stuff. So you wanted it to work yeah. because you could see that you know they obviously cared for each other. Yeah, tied with Beverly and Angelo. Yeah, you know, Beverly, unfortunately, that didn't last. But yes. but yeah. while it lasted, it, it, it was good. It doesn't last though. Yeah, you can yeah, have love that doesn't yeah. last. Yeah. You can oh, have love okay, that. Right. I mean, everybody's loved somebody and like something seconds. has happened. Okay, so what's sorry? the number four? Um, uh, well, I, I don't know if I want to put this one at number four. Okay. Um, should I save it? Okay. Mm -hmm. What's number four? Okay. Um, this is an international one. Okay. I would say, sadly, Karuche and Chris. It was a very... You got to tie it in. You have to say Karuche, Rihanna and Chris. Because <laughs> no, their stories I mean, I'm together. a Rihanna fan, so naturally I would want to say Rihanna and Chris. But after watching an interview of um, her talking about the relationship and, you know, just how sad and hurtful she was that it got played out in front of the world. Mm -hmm. And she just seemed like a nice girl Person. that just kept on making the wrong decisions and going back. Mm. So. Okay. Maybe this is going to be like sad love stories. I know, right? At this <laughs> point, Sorry. I'm like, you know. People are just breaking up and dying. Okay, if you had to contribute one, who would you contribute? Who do you think? I don't know. Love stories. I honestly can't think of anyone. Right now, though, maybe I'll go with my guy, Kanye. As much as people don't like them. Mm -hmm. I like how much he stands up for her. I love how much he stands people up for her. People have said the vilest things. Yeah. The most unbelievable crap yeah. about her yeah. to him. And about him to her and about them together mm -hmm. but every single time i'm not saying they're going to last forever but i mean i just like how they don't really care even yeah. if they do care yeah they make it look like they don't care yeah. and what i love you know. about their relationship is the product of their relationship northwest yes mm -hmm. i think she is just she's adorable and she just she's kanye mm -hmm. she looks like kanye so bad she's coming no she's coming for everybody you can tell <laughs> <laughs> you just have that. <laughs> Her and Blue Ivy. Oh, speaking of Blue Ivy, She's I guess we could Blue put Jay Z Ivy. and Jay Z and Beyonce. Nice. <laughs> um, okay. Yeah, I, don't, I don't know that I really like their love actually. Yeah, Jay -Z I, and I think it's quite you know, it's like a hip hop kind of like. I also it's like feel a, like there's a lot that we don't know. That mm. I just feel like there's a lot of make too much. They're mysterious, man. right? Yeah. And it's too so much. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know that I really like it. Okay. Um, so, what, where I are like we? I like Michelle and Barack, actually. I love yes. Michelle and Barack. Yes. I like Michelle and Barack. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. You know, there's a picture of her when her skirt was almost getting blown up. Mm -hmm. When and they were going up a, a plane or something. And he was putting it down. He was, yeah. yeah. You know, moments like that where he's yeah. very That's the real stuff, isn't it? That's the real stuff. I feel mm -hmm. like she's the boss, though. <laughs> well. Well. Who is it? <laughs> um, He's the boss of the free world. And she's, she's the, the boss, boss in the house. house. That's she's okay. the boss of him. He can't be the boss of everything. My <laughs> number one um, is Two Face and Annie. Mm. Um, again, another beautiful story. They, yeah. they found each other at the end, man. Yeah. Whether or not the world liked it. They've been together forever, actually. Mm. They've known each other for years. Yeah, they've known each other for a really long time. Yes. Think about how old the African Queen music video mm. is. Yeah. But they've, they've known for like four years before that video. Okay. So it's been like, Yeah, I don't know. they've at least been, <laughs> they've been in each other's yeah. lives for a very well, long time. I mean like almost two decades, actually. Yeah, so 20 years. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Mm. All right, well, those are our love stories. You guys let us know if you agree or disagree. Um, and, you know, share some of your favorite love stories, Africa or outside of Africa. Uh, it's time for us to welcome our guest for the, for the day. She's uh, the very beautiful, very talented very radio funny. personality in Lagos at um, Rhythm but FM. And she's a voiceover artist and a potential Nollywood next starlet. Please girl. welcome Omalicha. 
Anita is there. Nobody knows her real name. Ah. Hi. Hello. Hello. Looking very, very trendy. Very bright. Very bright. Looking very Amalitra. Oh, hi. Welcome. Complex. <laughs> <laughs> welcome, welcome. Ah, uh, yes. Hi. Nice. Crap. <laughs> you can have a seat. Right? <laughs> welcome back. Oh, yeah, I could have called me crap, let me do. No, no. Uh, you know I didn't. Did you say you crap or crabs? Crap. Crabs? Yeah, wow. you're making it worse. I thought it was crabs. <laughs> no, oh. you know what? That would just, make a lot Let's go of ahead sense. and just not. Um, <laughs> how would you describe your personality? Hmm. In one word. Your character as 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 I don't think I should be describing myself. I think someone should. Oh, but but she's nice. <laughs> <laughs> she seems nice. Okay, she seems. Mm -hmm. That's how it starts. Um from what you already know. From what I know, um I would say free. No. Yeah. I feel like there's free spirited? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about just character, a, just character like a but there's joy. things I've noticed, and from what things that you say, that I just kind of like. You're obviously a very loyal friend. Yes, yes, very loyal friend because you can just tell. So that I noticed. So, but you know, we. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she's like, she's like, yeah, yeah. She's like, yes, I am. They don't, they don't All my are. friends better send me some gifts. I know <laughs> all of them. No. <laughs> but yeah. Do you How find that you, do you do you find that you? relate more with people who are like you or you know they say opposites attract yeah. and with friends now not of the relationships with friends do you have friends or are your friends like you or are they like opposite yeah, like i'll go in and like kind of like Ooh, or are they just they're quiet they're kind of in between people. i've got cr really crazy okay yeah <laughs> the comment yeah <laughs> um i've got the difference very different yeah. I, I, I accommodate everyone okay do you understand yeah. so i'm open i'm people are different yeah yeah, just a, you know, if you have a guanje issues, just leave me. Hey. Yeah. What's our guanje issues? <laughs> <laughs> What's our guanje issues? You know, Please, for our, for our viewers in like, uh, Uganda that don't know what our guanje is, please explain. Guanje <laughs> is a type of spirit. <laughs> <laughs> it's a type of behavior, you know? One minute you're okay, next minute you're fighting me for no reason. The other minute, you know, some other time, you know, you have issues. Okay, people who are just not consistent. Just issues. And you're, you're seeking for serious attention. You don't care about anyone else. Uh, yeah, people who are that, that type of friend that drain well, you oh, and drain yeah. you. Yeah, I know Agwanji. And that. drain you. <laughs> 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 All right, guys. Well, let's quickly go on another break. And when we come back, we're going to be talking about love languages. Stay mm. tuned. Welcome back to the spot. And today's topic is love languages. Does anyone know what a love language is? Oh, me? No, I don't know. I really don't. No? Okay. I don't really. I don't really Somebody didn't do their homework. Oh. Have you seen love she without said She was going to answer. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. I'm sorry. My, my meaning <laughs> uh -huh. oh, okay, is how you express your feelings towards someone. Yes. Words Very close. Half mark. Action. Half mark. <laughs> Words, actions, and gifts. Yes. But that's that what it writes. No, no, no. It, it, <laughs> gifts. No, it's true. Um, a gift giving is actually one of the five which is now which are now six um love languages it is actions um words or used to express your commitment to your partner uh, so what are the six okay so there's um gift giving quality time um gift quality time physical expression physical words um words mental stimulation Mental stimulation food, and language. food, yeah. Mental the last, the last one to be added was food. Okay. I don't think that's. I mean, food. Not, f not, f not food. As in, let me feed you. As yeah, in, like no. the act of, let's say, your partner is sick or something, and, and they can't do anything, oh. and you cook for them, okay. or uh, you know, you just enjoy giving them different types of dishes that you know they love, and oh. you go out sex your way. The physical I was gonna say yeah. yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Because I, I was very angry just now. Why? <laughs> Can you know, it's a very for some people it's very important. <laughs> no, yes, it is. <laughs> it, but it comes under physical. People oh, who are like touchy feely, affectionate. Yeah. I was gonna yeah. say food, yeah. They, they need to express like. But I don't think people who are touchy feely don't want to have a lot of sex. Yeah, no, it's it's, some this, people. it's part of, it mm. comes under... Yeah, all physical. Yeah, it's all physical. What do you think I disagree. <laughs> what, do, what do you think your love language is? Yeah. Uh, Why are you starting with me? <laughs> yeah, the guy here now. So answer. What is, as in how I show love or how I like to be shown? No, how, your love no, language no, is how you like to be shown. Mm. Yes, how you like to be shown. How I like to be shown. Yeah. 
Hmm. Interesting. Eh? So what do we? Hmm. Physical expression, mental stimulation. Mental stimulation. Okay. Really? Yes. So you guys sit down and then do weakest link. Perhaps. <laughs> <laughs> Which is what um, I, I think Oracle called. Uh, exactly. um, yeah. Oh, of course. Okay. Yeah. That, yeah. That Maybe it also comes on that there's quality time there, right? Yes. Yeah. Spending time and just talking. Yeah. I was against. I mean, you can't have sex every morning, every and afternoon, gifting every night, as well. every evening. Of course not. So yeah. Buy a machine. Uh, exactly. <laughs> so no. it's more conversational for yeah. me. What's your and, love? Oh, okay. And what? No, I was going to say, um, how do you show your love language to your person? Like, are you to more your, a gift yeah. giver? Are you more a, I'm not a mental? Gift giver, are you more a. Okay. Yeah, we know. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's really, he's really terrible. What sort of a gifts. human being is this? I look at him <laughs> lost in over your bottles. <laughs> I'm a gift lover. That's, that's my gift to you. Oh. <laughs> terrible. What yeah. am I? Um, I'm learning to spend the quality time part. Okay. Because I feel like that's my weakest of exactly what's that gift giving. So I'm trying to up that the most. Then I also think mental stimulation as well. Okay. Okay. Wow. When, when the physical is called for, I'm always like, yes. <laughs> wow. I'm like, so how do you show the person that you love, that you That's love what I'm saying. So you just time, stay physical, away physical, time. Physical, physical quality time. You're learning. Stimulation. He says he's learning how to show quality time. Yeah. Like, like, before now, what, 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 you just said, hello, so let's have mental stimulation. Okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> hello. Hello, it's time for mental stimulation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, let me talk to you. <laughs> it's called another phrase, but yeah. Oh yeah. my God! Yes, it is. Yeah. I know what you're talking about. Oh, oh my God! Yes. Which yes, we can't yes, say yes. on air. It's not fun sex I'm talking about. No, it's already. not fun. Because <laughs> you're already thinking <laughs> about it. <laughs> it's a different yeah. type of sex. I'm rust. Yeah. Oh, you're yeah. oh, Are you okay. battered? Let's see. You're me. mentally battered. Sanctify my brain. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Okay, um, so I want to go with you. I think how I ex uh, express. Um, love is through quality time um physical hey. uh, not may Holy not be beef, that kind of physical I know a couple of boys i'll be very happy mm -hmm. <laughs> um and food i love to, to take care nurture and okay. feed um and then how i like to receive the love back is quality time um mental stimulation and um you know gift giving is not a bad thing <laughs> So you will not give, but you receive. I like you. <laughs> I, I, I'm giving in the form that I can. You understand? Which this is, is my love language. Which is physical. So you give physical and they give you gifts. <laughs> <But it's laughs> <horrible. laughs> Please, <laughs> please, please don't said. make Zena up to, to be something that she's That's not what I meant. That's not what I meant. I give food too. Wow. Okay. Oh, That's money. very deep. <laughs> oh, my, my love language. Mm -hmm. What's your, what do you think your love language is? What do you like to give? What do I like to give? I like her. I like to cook. Okay. Yeah. I take care of. I'm. I'm the adai in my house, oh, so it okay. comes with the territory. I'm very protective. Yeah. 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 Um, I like to give love. I like to give. I don't know. Some kind of a add value to your life. You know. Some so yeah. mental stimulation. Mental stimulation. Mm -hmm. I hear work wise, and then. Um, you will not give <coughs> gifts, Abi, but you want gifts. What's he talking? All of you are the same. <laughs> you are not giving gifts. All of you have said gifts. I didn't giving. say that. Who's I wasn't. I'm gifting. That? Do you know how hard it is to stand and cook in the kitchen? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so how long it takes. So yes. what do you like to receive? I like to receive little things. Little things in the sense that call me randomly. Okay. Yeah? Send me a text message. Yeah. Just show that you care. So thoughtful. About your, yeah. Are you a hopeless like romantic? I feel like you are. You know, it's, it's very, it's just, Girl. I'm so crazy. <laughs> 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 because I, I come across as strong. And I am tough. strong, you know, but at some point, I want you to just trick yeah, the Yeah, but relationships are different. I mean, yeah. no matter how strong you are in your mm. daily life, mm -hmm. work and all, I just with need relationships, you need to... A place where I can... <sighs> yeah, where you can just, just kind of be Oh, I like to be. Peace. And oh, another thing is you have to rub my hair. Ooh, girl. Ebukaz loves that. He loves that. <laughs> all right, guys, before we get too carried away, uh, we're going to go on a quick break. When we come back, find out my love language. We'll see you in a minute. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to The Spot. Hopefully you've been joining in on The Convo online via Facebook, Twitter, and of course you can always send us an email on entertainment at ebonylivetv.com. We're still talking about love languages, which is the way you express commitment to your mate and how you also like to um, receive, get, it. receive love back. And everybody's been sharing their love languages. I was going to say, yeah, we haven't heard yours. You haven't heard mine. You also dodge. My, no. What's yours? 
My love language is uh, I'm very I'm a very touchy feely person. I'm okay. very affectionate. So in say it's physical. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, I don't know what's wrong with you. I'm yeah, trying to explain like, it. Physical, physical. Yes, physical. Yes, yeah. physical. So I'm very like I like hugs and you know that kind of stuff and all that kind of stuff. So physical. <laughs> And uh, oh, quality time, <laughs> She's sweetheart, quality like. time, and mental stimulation is how I. Yeah, the typical Nigerian wife. Ah, uh, I don't know problem. if I don't know if people that know me would say that. <laughs> no, you that's are. That's how you show. That's how I. Sh that's how I show. Oh, that's I, how you show. Yeah, okay. that's how I show. Like if I if I take time out to spend with you okay. and I, yeah that. Um, actually, I'm actually a quite. I'm I'm a bit of a gift giver as well. I tend to it actually beats. give gifts. A gift, give, it's okay. Gift. <laughs> give, <laughs> give, give. <laughs> I like to give gifts. <laughs> They're giving, giving, giving gifts. <laughs> I like it. You want to give? How I like to receive as well. is um is actually I, I like when people are affectionate okay. as well. So physical, touchy yeah, touchy, okay. touchy feely. Yeah. Like I like people that like to hug and stuff like that. Yeah. So um. physical, um, mental stimulation. And quality time, physical, um, physical in the sense of what exactly? exactly. No, physical, no, like because she likes to give no, her. No, this is the thing. Mm. She likes to be like, You be quiet. Be quiet. Are you the giver physically? <laughs> <laughs> You're trying yeah. to cause trouble in this place. All I'm saying is, you know, like if you're walking down, like I'm, a, I'm I like PDA. Oh, Not PDA yes. like slop down in the street, okay. but like if Just if we're together going, somewhere, like if we're sit together, if we're sitting together, like you know maybe you're holding hands. We don't have to always be in each other's pockets, but like I I like you know when someone expresses that oh they care about you oh you know and they're like oh that kind of thing. Know, so. is quite far. <laughs> I like how you didn't move your hand. Oh right? It wasn't me, it was that. Do you like PDA? Of course. Uh, uh, I, I used to say no, but then I met the one. That ah. was very PDA ish. The one. But you switch her. PDA you know, when is sweet, man. It's sweet. Because when you're. I when love you're levels. Yeah. There's levels to it, though. Let me tell you something that happened. I went for a wedding. I do. And then I, I, I was tired from work, and then, you know, you just, you know when you see that one person, like your friend, your family, and you're just like, home, you know? Mm -hmm. So I got down from the car, and then he comes to me and kisses my forehead, kisses my lips, and then hugs me. The type of feeling <laughs> I felt. Right. Was it, it was a sweet feeling. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> it's better than Dodo and Beans. <laughs> <laughs> That's so, and he, he held my hand and then walked to me. And that's sweet. So I like PDA. Yes, of course I like yeah. PDA. So yeah. I, you know, it's it's it's. I think it's um, it's it's very interesting because I've heard about it a lot recently. I think it's like a modern way of people trying to figure out each other in relationships because now there's a lot of you know yeah. conflict in relationships and people are trying to figure out ways around it. So. Um, I think I read like an article that said the problems that come up in relationships sometimes is you feeling that you're not valued because the person yeah, that you're with doesn't, doesn't speak your love language. Yeah. Meanwhile, that other person also Very feels like true. you don't understand. I'm giving you my love how I know how Very to show it. True. So you need to learn how to speak the other person's love language at least a little bit so that they understand that you know they're valued by you and then you can also very, feel valued by true. them so that's where so how do you do that do you have this conversation for example with the person well, that's well, okay what are your love languages there are, yeah. well, there are different out. ways yeah you're supposed to notice there, it there are different ways to identify what your love lang love language is and your partners um you can do it there are questionnaires <sighs> that ask you know different things like how do you like to um relax with your partner Mm. Is it going out to a restaurant to eat or is it just sitting at home cuddled up in front of a movie? Sitting at home cuddled up in front of a movie is more physical, touchy, quality time. Going out to eat is more food related kind yeah, of thing. Stimulation. And then there's also having the discussion. So it's and, and this is the problem with a lot of relationships. People don't communicate very well. Yeah. Yeah. So I expect you to know that. OK, I'm having a bad day today or, yeah. um, you know, I really need something. I've told you that I have an issue that you can help me with, but I'm not actually asking you for help. So it's sitting down and, you know, just saying, you, mean, yeah. you know, these are the oh, kind please, of things that I like. Well, so I wanted to ask 
You know, this ah. is a very, we're very sensitive people, like women. Yes, general. it's very hard oh, to Calm down first. first. Calm Let me just say a word. Calm down. You are just not gifting. Not gifting. No gifting love, love. I'm okay. You might be like, but you're not okay. When, when was the last time I, you asked me I, what the problem I'll was? I'll stop asking because you never tell me. Why are you, you see, this is, this, is a, this, is a, this is an example of somebody whose language <laughs> is zero. It's just messed up. No, but just to, to be very, very honest, a lot of guys find it very hard to understand. Tell you when you be like, okay. You ask the first time the person says it's not a problem. Then later you're not angry that I didn't ask further. Do you know what I'm well, saying? Why didn't sometimes you ask there's a thin line sometimes. between asking further and the person getting irritated. Well, because the person some, girls, the person some girls get ticked off, like, stop it. I, I said I'm fine. But it sometimes happens. is it not you worth it? And then, and then what you should do from there is to try to understand if, if there's a pattern. So, for yes. instance, if you're asking her if she, uh, how she is and she's saying, leave me alone, whatever, and you notice that after a couple of days, she comes back or she starts to, you know, just kind of drop little, little, little hints, hints yeah. or things like, oh, you know what, uh, my day at work wasn't really that great or whatever. Then maybe it's, that's when she wants to start talking. So maybe we can talk about it then or can, you can start asking questions. I have a question. Like, what if the guy... guy my yes, to <laughs> What if the guy is a sort of person who, because it's, it's, it's a, it's a hundred hundred. I don't do, I don't believe in 50, 50. Mm -hmm. It's a hundred hundred. So what if the guy is the sort of person that likes to deal with issues? I want to talk about it now mm. and here. Exactly. I'm that That's kind of person. So, you know, so like in a how do you balance it out? If well, we, we're going to oh, answer okay, that we'll come back. after the break. Stay tuned. <laughs> Welcome back. You're still watching the sport and we're talking love languages. Now, before the break, Omalicha asked a very, very good question mm -hmm. about, you know, communication. I think yeah. that's about, you know, when one person is more a talker and another person is more a waiter. Mm. But one person is more of a dealing with, of the issue dealing with dealing now. issues point, now and another person is more uh, what likes to wait things uh -huh. out and then be more in the zone. How do you handle that? She's going to answer. I'm, um, I found that of recent, I'm the um, now person. Okay. Before, I would do what Ibuka um, described, which was... Um, I'll be like, I don't want to talk about it, and then we go away. Okay. As the, because I know during the break, Lamy Day was saying that if I can't handle this situation right now, I'm going to tell you, let's no, not talk about yeah. it. But for that person who wants to handle it right yeah. now, they cannot sleep, they cannot no, eat, they yeah. cannot yeah. function, anything yeah. until they handle it. Oh, so nice. one thing, well, the, the first thing that popped up in my head is um, something that I watched during um, a TV series called How I Met Your Mother. <laughs> Now, there are two characters. <laughs> um, gosh, why do their names go? Ted? No, not Ted. Lily Barney? and... Um, oh, Lily and, and um, Marshall. Yeah, Lily and Marshall. Whenever they're having like an argument or something, they have a habit of hitting pause. So if it gets too much or somebody's about to deviate off the topic, they'll say pause. And they, and they go into like normal mode. So let's say you and your partner are, um, you're having this argument and you're in the middle of um, dinner at home and he wants to talk about it and you don't want to, but you just, you realize what you're doing and you both just say, we're gonna take a time out. Pause, yeah. We will revisit this at another time. time. Yeah. And then you I come back to it. Gotta I be, can't switch off. I love pauses, Compromise. they work perfectly. Yeah, I, I like, off. well, I, I practice safe words, well. Mm. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> girl, she said safe word. Okay. No. If you know what a safe word is. I thought I was like, I thought I was like, ah. I thought I was going to say that. <laughs> the question I have is, you know, as you grow, you change. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Especially as a woman. Mm -hmm. Your body changes, your emotions change, and so on and so forth. Now, will your love language change? What if it changes? Yeah. And then you're mar you got married to this person while well, you were. You were still a you certain were still, way. Well, well, see, with that, I actually think that's actually pretty normal. Because uh, a 16-year-old me's love language might be, oh, ah, he bought me flowers, or I like the gifts, or, mm -hmm. or whatever. <clears throat> but like the 20-year-old me is different from 25-year-old me, is different from 30-year-old me. Mm -hmm. But when you get married to somebody, I think you get married to somebody knowing that over time, things will change. The point is constant communication and compromise. Key. And yeah. Yeah. That's, that's it, team. really. Team and you, you still have to, it's when, you, when you notice that, actually really yeah. don't like gifts anymore or whatever then you'd be like oh babe you don't have to buy me flowers every tuesday anymore like you used to it do changes, or whatever yeah. it's okay let's do something else or oh, whatever the case sense. may be okay. i think that's really the best way to do it to do. hey <laughs> take safe your words. love I language home. Have... what's one of your safe words Ooh, sorry <laughs> i know so, you know like, he, he got lost for a moment where did you go to i, mean, I actually know I another know, I might not be pg rated you went to 50 shades. I, I know another person that um you know, during confrontation with um, 
their partner and stuff, yeah. they will try to dilute the situation. By laughing. By not even laughing. So either paying compliments or just saying, I love you. And it, it oh. makes her like, are you really gonna do this right yeah. now? <laughs> but then she just, I know someone she, that does it she as well. like breaks down and, and yeah. she pretty much forgets whatever what it, it is, is that she's arguing yeah, about. It works, That's it works magic, tool. especially if you are, uh, I'm, I'm if you're hot and your smile is hot too. It doesn't work for me. Yeah, Somebody's I get, actually I done that for me. And I'm, I love you too, but we still have an issue. <laughs> but you see, we still and not that I don't, not that because I want to <laughs> fight, but it's like, you're literally, what it is is that you're trying to, when it's an issue where you're just trying to cover it, I, I love you too, and that's, and I, I love that you love me, but really, we need to talk but this out because it's going to come, it's going it to happen again. It actually worked because what, what, you just calm down. I love you too. Yeah. You, <laughs> just, okay, fine. I love you. But, but let's still talk about this thing. <laughs> <laughs> like, I think I it's, it's, it's very, the, the most complex for me is like, I, the first question I asked you about whether your opposites attract. And with relationships in particular, now I think it's really very, people tend to find themselves out, sometimes too late. Yeah. You know, these things, which is why when you get into a marriage, and I realize, what was I what? doing? Who is this person, you know? Mm -hmm. So it's, it's very important, like you said, communicating and making sure you understand each other. Yeah. I think you Maybe can, not as really early enough, but as, as soon as you can. You can yeah. never totally it's understand so someone. No, it's, of course not, but I mean, those but things yeah. like this is the core, communication, yeah. how the person reacts to certain things. Yeah. Okay, what kind of woman would you like? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Particular, like what kind of what money, attracts what way you, now? like character or... Yeah, yeah not like look. Okay. Okay. No, 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 not physical. If you're going to date any... I'm not sure if I've <laughs> That's actually, this is the wrong question exactly. to ask. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Yeah, no, don't do that. <laughs> okay, so if you're going to date... A random girl? <laughs> <laughs> no, character-wise, I suppose. Mm -hmm. Like, what's the characteristics? What, what, the, what are the building blocks? Of the kind of person. I'm not the biggest talker, so I like someone who's more. What's he talking now? Seriously. What's he talking about? Oh, no. No, in relationships, actually, I'm not. So I'm not the talker. What do you mean you're not the talker? I Meaning you're not going to ask her out or you're, no, you're just not going to. I'm talking speak. about you're the quiet spending one. Spending time together. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I, I've dated. Most people I've dated are more talkative. So I like that. Yeah, because if people if you're drier different. than me, I would think that he would talk he the talk out. <laughs> me, right? Because yeah, in no. a relationship, like like we said, yeah. you're you're different. Yeah, if you're drier than me, it's a problem because we'll just be like. <laughs> <laughs> pause. <laughs> yes. We'll pause the whole pause, day. <laughs> pause. Okay. okay. So. Yeah, that. So. And, and of course, I talk about mental stimulation. I like someone who knows a little something about everything because I like to go all over the place. I watch anything on TV. Okay. So I like someone who has li who has like at least small sense about okay. certain things, you know. Okay. Small fear of God is nice, though. Because Small. No, oh, you, I'm not saying you should be a reverend sister, but at least no, I know, understand but you that mean, life is not about you. You know, okay. there's a greater being that, okay. you know, it does help. That's interesting. Yeah. I want, I want to know her. I, I know a couple people <laughs> that have not taking about this show, She really has. It's I know. The, I'm like, oh, oh, the viewers are her. very happy, right? No, no. <laughs> I just want to know, because I know that people have a crush on her, and I know a specific kind of man that loves you. I'm not sure. Are you are you single? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> then I must I'm, I'm, I'm taking I'm taking interviews. I'm taking interviews. Am I single? Sure. Girl, I'm take. Let them see me first. <laughs> <laughs> so what what uh, kind of person um, would you date? See, the, just like you, I'm a very. When people meet me, I'm very um, tough. There's a hard outer I'll shell. Look but so damn it, I'm just about to reveal all my secrets. I am all mushy inside. Like it's it's Ooh, disgusting. <laughs> you, know, you know what the problem is? Before you break through that hardcore. Ooh. No, of course. Yes, I was Some people say, get tired in the process tired. of hacking. Oh, they're not worth it. It's true. Because <laughs> the core is hard. <laughs> <laughs> it's not supposed to be easy. Very thick core. Like. <laughs> Please you have a seat. Oh my gosh, please have a seat. Yeah, so um, oh my gosh. When, it, your when it comes to partners, <laughs> I, I like strong characters. Um, I like people who are driven. Mm -hmm. um, and again, the affectionate thing, just the simple things. Um, coming home and well, there is. Like, I like that, like, wow. Yeah, rubbing my feet. Like, you I know? love foot rubs. Yeah, oh but my gosh. I, I guess it's time you for us your to take virus, a, Yes, it's time for us time to take for another us break. To take a break. We haven't done anything else in this show, but I talk know, about I'm love sorry. languages. But we're going to go on another break and we'll be right back. So please stay tuned. <laughs> Welcome back to the spot. Uh, we've been having a good time here talking about love languages with Omalucha. 
Um, it's almost time for us to go, but before we do, uh, shall we do Ox the Spot really quickly? I'm and then our... question, Shabai, it's okay. <laughs> Oh, what, what was the question? What was the question what again? Kind of men, yeah, right. oh, okay. oh, Lamine, the kind what of kind of men do you, yeah, do you we'll like? We'll do segment eight today. Do you attract? <laughs> um, someone with integrity. Wow. Someone who is loyal. Okay. Um, I also like an affectionate person. Uh, I like a smart person. And... Uh, Think of First look, though, you're not going to know if a person is loyal. No, you, I mean, we're talking about character, right? Oh, okay. the, the kind of character that I get. Yeah, okay. That's the kind of character that I like. And those, oh. are the kind of, it, those, are the, those are the kind of values I try to make sure that I also have. Oh. Because why would you want somebody who's that great and you're yeah, horrible? No, yeah, <laughs> you know? sense, So yeah. that's it. Okay. All right. So let's so ask the spot. Ask the spot. Do you have? Yes. Okay. Um, okay. Oh, can <laughs> each presenter say who their worst guest was? Who their least wow. favorite guest was. That's just deep. That's actually quite deep. The huh? episodes where we didn't have a guest. Wow. See, diplomatic. Ah. Diplomatic ah. indeed. Yes, yes. always. Yes. Um, They're my friend. <laughs> <laughs> who come for me. Yeah. I know. <laughs> quick, quick. Okay, I, I'm not going to say who the worst guest was, but Why? I'll just say, you know, just people who are, they don't tend to open up and they come and They're be like, like mm. super cool mm. and, you know, they don't really get to have fun. Okay, yeah, same answer. Right. Next question. And I'm diplomatic. So no, I'm trying to be. <laughs> what part of your? This is the last question. What part of your job do you hate? <laughs> um, it's the technical difficulties. I hate when I have to wait for. Maybe, maybe I'll just ask if flight delays. When we're mm. expecting guests. Yeah, logistics issues actually are the worst. Lord. Logistics issues it's are actually insane. the worst. Those are the you worst You know what parts. I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah. When, you, yeah. When, when someone doesn't come in on time because of something else. Yeah. yeah. Those are the, actually, those are the worst ones. Who's the worst person you've ever interviewed? Ha, in it's not me asking this question. <laughs> uh, least favorite. Ah, God. Okay, maybe say then. <laughs> <laughs> maybe say what it was about them that you didn't like. Maybe not, if you don't want to name names. So you come into the radio station. This is not TV. Yeah. You come into the radio station. You know, some people have a perception that, okay, when this is the presenter, the presenter is going to fall in love with you. Oh. Stop and it. it. And they try to give you the whole... Stop it. Oh. <laughs> I'm, right I'm, I'm, I'm not even going to say anything. You mm -hmm. ask a question or get mm -hmm. people, you ask questions and they, they don't know the answer to the question or they don't understand. Oh. For instance, what kind of music do you do? How can you not know the kind of music well, do you do? Well, you know. <laughs> it's, one of my, it's one of the, my pet peeves with interviews. I find that a lot of people in Nigeria never mm -hmm. know the answer to that question. Mm -hmm. And I don't understand why. What's I mean, I can, genre, see, yeah. I can see the fact, I, understand, I can see why they would not know to an extent because a lot of music these days just... Like the Paco music. Mix it. Yeah, but mm -hmm. I'm like, can you define yourself at least? Try and right. walk towards something. I'm so a, you have I'm a brand a and identity. I'm a pop artist. Never, they never really know. Oh, you have give like sunglasses on all the chains in the world, man, to pass uh, yeah. some... If, I mean, all of just, that with no knowledge actually irritates yeah. me. Sometimes I mean, like you know, there's all kinds of swag. Licking your lips. All swag, no substance. Thank you. That's the, uh, that's, yeah. I don't like, I don't like, you have to engage me. Make me think like, oh, you know? Yeah, mm. this guy has something or yeah. this person Fascinating has something. Show. Yes, make me go to Google. <laughs> <laughs> Use words that will make me that's say, ah, one. wait, hold it right there. That's a good one, you that's know? a good one. Okay. So who is this person you're talking about? Say what? <laughs> what do you talk? You want to get her in trouble. When we cut, we can have that conversation. Hmm. <laughs> I'll tell you guys later. Do you guys want to share a sweet spot? Zainab, do you um, have a sweet spot to share? Yes, I do have a sweet spot. Um... Okay, so when I'm going through a tough time and um, I need help, but I'm not going to ask for it because that's just the kind of person I am. I'm the golden angel, just come. Not you. What is wrong with you? Be bearded and bold. Yes, if you came bearded and bold, that would be that's good too. Um, I like beard and bald headed men. Um, <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> but um, back to the... Well, I, the, I understand, because I like hot bellies, I'm sorry. <laughs> you do? I am sorry. Uh, I mean, is that your sweet spot? Hot I belly, need, a pot, I and that guy with a pot belly. Chubby. You cannot be... I, know, like I have a problem with all this buff. I, I just cut me. <laughs> <laughs> no. I just need to be like, you know... Oh, Teddy yeah. oh, yeah. Bear. Yeah. Just a baby, no. Just like him. Oh, oh. there might be your love connection on the spot, guys. It might be your guys. That's a good buy, so that's the uh, yeah, yeah. For my second, let me twist you. <laughs> but I don't know who else gets my wife's boyfriend. Let me tell you about this trouble. Thanks, guys, for watching. See you next time. Bye. <laughs> hey, you Mark, they posted you. <laughs> I know, you're happy. Take you happy.
The spot was brought to you by Feroz.